All right, we back. Oh yeah, we had Omni Chair earlier. Forgot about that. Let's go get him. Who should be our special guest today? The Spyro to Ripto's Rage Guidebook. Classic. Needs to be a bit closer. You can't really see it. We got a Fortnite joke? Who is crazy enough to do that? Oh, just a second ago. Tasty Purple really saved up enough points. Yeah, there was a there was a Spyro 2 guidebook. I actually used this guidebook a lot. Because there was this one level that I couldn't figure out. And, uh... So I bought this guidebook, and it's a pretty nice guidebook. It has like, uh, it has like maps, like nice maps with like arrows and then like a step-by-step, -step, this is how you get through kind of thing. It was a good guidebook, and it, I mean, it's nice. It's a Prima guide. Prima guides are usually pretty good. There's the exception every once in a while, but it's usually pretty good. All right. Uh, I hope this was worth your points. Everyone, get ready. Brace yourself. Prepare your death you F in the chat. Here you go. For several months worth of of saving up your 4-8 points. Here is your Fortnite joke. Who's the most attractive mist monster? A cute zombie. Not, e not even a joke. <laughs> Not even a joke. <laughs> Wait. Hey. Oh, it's you. Proceed. Yeah, everyone knows me. Okay, these guys on the chocobos. Could they be any cuter? Wait, come back. I want to see. I want to see him walking again. There. Look. Oh my God. Look at that chocobo. That is adorable. And they just bounce up and down. Yo, Mavic, they really gifted sub to Tasty. Oh. Oh, man. This just blows Final Fantasy V out of the water. Like, the sound quality, not the actual music, but... Oh, my God, dude. This sounds like Final Fantasy IX-ish to me. Which means Final Fantasy IX sounds Final Fantasy VI ish. If I was wearing pants, I'd need new ones. Beyond is the Figaro Castle engine room, ready to leave at a moment's notice. Oh man. Figaro. That's dangerous! Okay, calm down, dude. Figaro Castle must be that one that moves. I know Final Fantasy VI has like a moving castle. Because it was in World of Final Fantasy. These thieves have been terrorizing the vicinity. Stay away from them. Okay. Here's another, here's another difference. Um, here's another difference from Final Fantasy V to Final Fantasy VI. Final Fantasy V would let you go down to the basement and then just get obliterated by some super enemy. <laughs> In this game, be like, oh, it's dangerous down there. Careful. I don't even think there's enemies down there. He just said it was dangerous because of the engine. Go see the king. Yeah, Final Fantasy II also. Well, V had a, had a castle with enemies in the basement, I think. It also had castles where you just walked in and died, so... 
It doesn't look like it, but this castle incorporates some of the most high-tech devices in existence. For example... Oops, they're all top secret. Wow. Such a cool-looking castle with, like, all the windmills and stuff. Oh. It's a store. This looks like normal prices. Tinctures aren't like 10,000 gil. Oh, there was a chest there that looks like a box, but it's not. It's a chest. Can't hide from me. Wouldn't you think that guy would open that chest and then sell the soft? Auto crossbow, noise blaster, bio blaster. Gases multiple enemies use with tools command. Huh. I'll buy one just to see what it is. It's just a freebie, so you buy more. Okay, I'm gone. I will say, I feel so slow after playing 5. So I can run everywhere in 5. You mean this young woman? Who do you think you are? Oh, sorry. How rude of me to turn my back to a lady. Wow, what a king. The young king of Figaro Castle, ally to the Empire, and a master designer of machinery. Wait, ally to the Empire? Why are we asking him for help then? Also, that picture is glorious. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> it's a jabated face. I am Edgar, King of Figaro. Surprised someone like me knows a king? Talk to you later. So, you're an Imperial soldier. No problem. Figaro and the Empire are allies. Please, relax while you're here. It's not in my blood to harm a lady. Look, why are you helping me? Is it because of my... Abilities? I'll give you three reasons. First of all, your beauty has captivated me. Second, I'm dying to know if I'm your type. I guess your abilities would be a distant third. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's with you anyway? Guess my technique's getting a bit rusty. I suppose a normal girl would have found him dashing, but I'm hardly normal. <laughs> I love that she said, like, Are you helping me only because of my abilities? And he's like, No, I'm only helping you because you're cute. It's kind of the reverse of what you would normally hear. Like, in, in normal, everyday life, you would hear a girl say, like, Are you only helping me because I'm a girl and I'm pretty? This is like the reverse. You're only helping me because I'm a magic wizard. No, nope, I'm only helping you because you're pretty. they go? They left me. Oh, the, the jam. Yes. The real version.
Well, I'm never going back in. <laughs> We're staying out here forever. hours left we got? Like six hours? Seven hours? Seven hours left? Let's listen to this. <laughs> Let's just customize the menu for the rest of the stream. That's so good, dude. Makes me wanna, makes me wanna like explore the world and not even go back in the castle. But I gotta go get my boys back. Wait! I just, I just walked out for like two seconds. Calm down. Oh wait, now I can go this way. Whoa, he did like an electric slide. Did you see that? These seeds have been terrorizing the vicinity. I can't talk to him even if I wanted to. There we go. I'm Lone Wolf, the pickpocket. That sounds familiar. Relax, they're just blowing off steam. But I'm telling you, there's no sense keeping us here. We're just small potatoes compared to the real threat lurking out there. And King Edgar knows it. there yet? Is this the library? Scholars the world over are doing research on magic. Silly people. Scholars. Long ago, a force called magic existed. People who used magic were called mage knights. I thought you said they were called demon witches of doom. Okay, I get it. I remember the name of the castle. Castle's huge. Weapons and items manufactured here are sent to South Figaro. There's a South? Alright, I walked up all that way just to learn that fact. So, why do these candle holders. I'm guessing it's a candle holder. They look like snakes. Does anyone else feel that way? I keep thinking it's a snake. Shotgun! Think of the 33! Welcome back, dude. Good to see ya. Is that a snack? How's it going, turkey? How's it going, Jim? Need a rest? In real life or the game? Oh, she did a slide. Though Edgar showers... Though Edgar showers his attentions on women, most are too smart to pay any attention to him. But he's the king. You don't want to be the queen? Seems like a nice guy. He recently tried to hit on the high priestess. Surely he's talked to you. 
I don't know why, but I find it so funny that like the king is a young guy that just hits on every woman in the whole the whole castle. And they all like know it. Like it's a meme around the castle, like, yep, Edgar's hit on me, he's hit on you, he's There's a new girl in town, he probably hit on her. I, I now understand the portrait, why he looks like a goofball. His Highness said he'd marry me when I got older. Alright, we're, we're pushing... We're pushing into a territory that I don't want to be in now. Edgar has a twin brother. He was such a nice boy. Oh god, the music stopped. It was creepy. I wasn't prepared. Brother, what's wrong with father? What's all this talk of his successor? Are you blind? Look how thin his face has become. Oh, this version of the song. What is it? Brother! Wait, his name is Youth? Tears? Okay, it was just saying he's a youth. Why did it just say, like, Edgar's brother, or, like, brother or something, or question marks? Edgar's twin brother, who traded the throne for his own freedom. Yes, his name is Sabin. Oh, he looked so like his father. Is it Sabin or Sabin? Because Sabin sounds like he's crying. I feel like it's Sabin. His name is Guile. He kind of looks like Guile, yeah. <laughs> Sabin. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. When he ran away, he was a sweet little child. I wonder what he's like now. Sabin. The Empire has smashed the three cities on the southern continent. Just a matter of time till they come up here. His name is Ronald. Well, we haven't gotten any names like Salsa yet, so we're doing good. So far, so good on the translation. Alright, so did something change now that I did that cutscene? Who's that? Oh, the Chancellor. The whole business of the succession was so repugnant to Sabin, the king's brother, that he fled the castle forever. The succession was settled with a coin toss. Wait, really? You just flipped the coin? How do you like my castle? King Edgar, someone from the Empire to see you. Probably Kefka. <laughs> what is that? What is that stance? Fooey, Emperor Gastal's stupid orders. Edgar, you pinhead! Why do you have to live in the middle of nowhere? These recon jobs are the pits. <clears throat> There's sand on my boots. Oh my god, I love them already. Yes, sir. All set, sir. Oh, there's the laugh. Idiots. Sir Kefka, what on earth do... Out of my way. Yeah, I love this. I, I love him already. <laughs> I knew I would love Kefka, just from what I've heard about him. Oh, I'm Edgar. But man, what a, what a great intro already. From the music to like the humor to like his his style is so good already. 
I thought we were allies. What are you doing in my domain? You've been busy down south, looking for more cities to destroy? That's for us to know. What brings Kefka, humble servant of Emperor Gestal, into our lovely, lowly presence? A girl of no importance recently escaped from us. We heard she found refuge here. <laughs> of no importance. Hmm, this wouldn't have anything to do with this witch everyone's been whispering about, would it? Lies! She merely stole something of minor value. Is she here? That's a tough one. You see, there are more girls here than grains of sand out there. I can't keep track of them all. I'd hate to be you if we find out you're lying. Waha! I truly hope nothing happens to your precious Figaro. He blew it, Edgar. I'd say that guy's missing a few buttons. Where's Tara? Wait, what did Chrono Trigger reference? The... the boots? Yeah, the laugh is, the laugh is in Final Fantasy VII. Is the laugh also in Chrono Trigger? Oh, yeah, yeah, at the fair. I remember. Yeah. Yeah, the laugh is in the Chrono Trigger fair. It's also in Final Fantasy VII. It's in the, uh... The little closet you can open in the hotel, but it's slowed down a bit. Um, yeah, Square Enix stuff. They they like to put Easter eggs like that in their games. There's a bunch of other ones. There's a uh, um, Xeno Gears reference in Final Fantasy VII. There's a Final Fantasy VII reference in Xeno Gears. A um, bunch of other things like that. Take her to her room. I'd love to chat with you, but the Chancellor and I must plan our strategy. Sometimes I hate being a king, if you'll excuse me. Follow me. <laughs> you first heard the laugh in a Sonic creepypasta. That is very unsurprising. What was the Final Fantasy VII reference in Xenogears? There's a picture of Tifa in one of the rooms in the... I, I don't remember. It's been a while since I played Xenogears, but uh, one of the main, like, towns or castles you go to, there's a picture of Tifa. Don't you worry about a thing, I'll... You're Locke, right? Edgar told me about you. Is it true you're a thief? That's Treasure Hunter! On the surface, Edgar pretends to support the Empire. The truth is, he's collaborating with the Returners, an organization opposed to the Empire. I am his contact with that group. The old man you met in Narsh is one of us. Empire, but I'm a soldier of the Empire. That's not true. They were using you. Things are different now. I don't understand. What should I do? I can't tell you what to do. You don't have to decide right now. You'll soon find your way. But how will I know which way is right? Well, the only people you've met from the Empire tried to kill you and was also a crazy demon clown, so I think the choice is kind of easy. Yeah, I agree, bro. Like, when I played Final Fantasy V, there were so many new references that I got in Final Fantasy VII, but like, I know that Nine is one of the biggest ones to reference the old games. They kind of made it as like a callback to the old games. So there's a ton of references that I'm gonna, like, understand now, playing through. So that'll be cool. What the...? 
Don't tell me the whole place is on fire. Oh. <laughs> I, knew it. I knew it was coming. What's happening? It's the Empire. It's Kefka. What are you doing? These guys are freaking out. Fire. <laughs> Bring me the girl, now! I don't know what you're talking about. Then, welcome to my barbecue! Wahaha! <laughs> fire, fire! Hey, hey, hey. Oh my god, creepy. Creepy minions. Fire, fire! They're like goblins. Get ready! Yes, sir! Change your mind. I guess I have no choice. Or maybe I do! Ack! Shameful that a king should flee, leaving his people behind. How utterly delightful. Jump! Wow, rip your whole... everyone from your kingdom. Okay, dive now! Yahoo! <laughs> that little like thing he did. Figaro submerge mode. No one can touch the people of Figaro. Now we have a fire castle underground. How did you... Did, why did you just jump in the front door? Go! Get them! <laughs> that was so funny that they were just flipped over. Uh-oh. They look very scary. I thought it was just going to be the thing from before, but... Like the same... Uh, the same sprite, but... Oh, here you go. Edgar can use tools. Boom. Oh my god, the damage. I don't feel like fire's gonna do a lot, but... Try oh, that wasn't good. Oh. We're getting smacked. Wait, what happened? Edgar, what's the matter? You look positively spooked. He looks like a Charlie Brown character. Did you just see what I saw? Yeah, this kid seems loaded for bear. She's amazing. That was magic. M ah, j ick. M magic. She used magic. Tara! Where on earth did you learn that? Sorry, I... Uh... Look, I didn't mean to make such a big deal out of this. Me either. It's just that I've never actually seen magic before. Where did you... Edgar, Tara, can use magic, and we can't. That's the only difference between us. The fact is, we can use her help. Thank you, Locke. Thank you, Edgar. Wait. Let me pause. <laughs> Let me pause this real quick. I just want to, uh... guy's just like, uh, it's fine. Take your time. I understand. You're having a crisis. <laughs> we'll wait. What the? <laughs> Stop swooning. <laughs> and then Locke falls over again. That whole time Locke was dead. 
<laughs> During that cutscene. Oh, that animation for the Phoenix down was cool. I'm glad they kept some of the humor from, uh, from 5. I think it's even better already. Oh, darn, I wanted to steal again. Bravo, Figaro! <laughs> Kepka's just watching angrily. Son of a submariner! They'll pay for this. This is great. Clap, 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 clap. That was a bad person? I, I'm scared. Terra, there's someone I'd like you to meet. We're members of the Returners. Our mentor, Bannon, would certainly like to meet you. Magic is going to be the key to winning this war. Magic. Terra has magical powers. That Esper seemed to react to her. Can there be some connection? I am at the foggiest. It just seems natural to me that I have the use of this power. But no human is born with the powers you seem to have, and... I apologize. What should I do? I'm sure the Empire is going to come after you. If they get their hands on you again, the world's finished. Terra, you want to understand your own powers, right? Then I think we need to consult with Bannon. Please. Okay, to the south there's a cave that leads to South Figaro. Whoa! 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 The ultimate mode 7. <laughs> oh my god. Is this PS5 graphics? Also, this version of the song is freaking incredible. Not gonna lie, I was expecting. Could have told me where we're going. But I don't want to go south. We can't go south. I know. <laughs> he told me where to go, and then I said he didn't tell me where to go. I'm sorry. What I meant was specifically where we're going. I don't care. I'm just exploring mode 7. Yeah, it looks like this is the only way to go. Looks like a cave. Is that a cave? Oh no, I can't like walk backwards. I have to turn. What the? Oh, okay. Squawk? Alright, let me look at some status here. So what? I like how Locke and Edgar don't even have MP. So, Edgar seems to be the strongest in terms of physical capabilities. 
And then Locke is obviously the fastest. And uh, Terra's in the middle with magic. Makes sense. Dude, I have 5,555 gill points. Epic. King Edgar, where are you headed? Through the cave and eastward to South Figaro. Return to the castle and tell the others we're safe. Yes, sir. Take care. Wait. Return to what castle? North Figaro? Because they're underground. I guess. I see a turtle. Terrifying Hornets. How much damage does this do if I hit everyone? Wait. Is this not... What? Do I get infinite of that? I thought it was a one-use thing. It says I have two of them. Maybe I got some somewhere and I didn't realize. But it doesn't list how many I have in the menu. That's why I'm kind of confused. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't list how many I have, so I think it's just infinite. I wish I had bought those other ones then. Edgar, big strong. What did I say before? Stealing is good? I'm starting to take that back. Wow, okay. Well. Buy any tools I find for now on. <laughs> Dig back the Figaro. Yeah, I'm sad I didn't buy those. But I thought they were one use. Because they were really cheap, so I thought they were, thought they were one use. Ew! What is this, Hollow Knight? Wow, why would I ever attack with Edgar? Oh, he gave me heartburn. There we go. Well. Every fight in here is totally free. Yo, Mike with the 10 gifted sub bomb. Get some love in the chat for Mike. Thank you so, so much. Thanks so much for all the support this week. It's been incredible. Alright, well all I'm getting is tonics, and tonics kind of suck, so I might stop stealing. Patience. 
I know, I'm just trying to, like, not win every fight in two seconds with the auto crossbow. But, like, yeah, I mean, you might as well, right? while you take a shower. I hope it's a quick shower. Oh, the jam. I kind of want to go back and look at more of that cave. I kind of I kind of accidentally went right through. Yo, oops, with the five gifted subs as well. Thank you so much. What if I just auto crossbow every fight? chest. Probably gonna be a tonic. It's either a tonic or Shinryu. Zayden. I loved 5. 5 is like probably my favorite retro Final Fantasy. Um, like I, there was just a lot that I really really liked about 5. What's my favorite sprite thus far? Uh, in this game, or total? In this game, probably that Magitek armor we just fought. That was really cool. Really cool sprite. Yo, Jason, they give it the nine months. Welcome back, dude. Enjoy the double buster sword badge. <laughs> the Mog portrait was pretty good too, yeah. Who's more difficult, Omega or Shinryu? I would say Omega just because he's more gimmicky. Shinryu was easy once I knew what I had to do. Omega, like, I didn't understand what I needed to do for a very long time. And after the game was over, people told me, like, what the... Um what the cheese was, but to be honest, I don't think it was really cheese. Like, you still have to level up to get the skills to use them, like... Apparently you can stop him, but I've heard that even when you stop him, like, he can still wreck you when he gets unstopped, so I don't even really think it's a cheese. It's just something that works really well against him. It by no means makes, makes the fight free. Wow, I got like two steps. I heard something about the chicken knife, but no one really, like, explained it. If I had to make a top three favorite Final Fantasy starting weapons... Not sure what you mean. Because these early games... 
They just get like daggers. <laughs> like just regular weapons. They don't really get like starting weapons until seven with the Buster Sword, I would say. It's the first like memorable starting weapon. But if that's what you're talking about, I guess, like... Hmm. Maybe... Buster Sword, Gunblade... Brotherhood? I also really liked Orin's sword, too. Orin's starting sword is cool. Also, the Brotherhood isn't technically Titus's starting weapon, but it's it counts. <laughs> yeah, I, I would say it counts, because, like, you know, it's his real starting weapon. They, calling, calling Titus's starting weapon the long sword or whatever he starts with is like saying that Sora's real weapon is the wooden sword. <laughs> like, no, he doesn't have a keyblade. He has a wooden sword to start. That's his true weapon. Alright, I think I got everything. I, there might be something over there, but... Yeah, the first gun blade is called Revolver, I think. If you could do a wooden sword playthrough, which you can't, but if you could... Oh my god, what are those? Those look like the... The nut enemies from Seven. Um, yeah, you can't do a wooden sword playthrough. It goes away from your inventory, but if you could, it would be... A complete nightmare, because the wooden sword actually doesn't do damage to Heartless. What is that thing? Kind of reminds me of a Chocobo Eater. Wow, still tonics. <laughs> is that Reptar? Yeah, that would be terrible. You couldn't do any damage. Dolan and Goffy would have to kill everything for you, and yikes on that. Because they're really bad in one. Like, borderline useless in Kingdom Hearts 1. Chocobo ride for 80 GP. Nice. Oh my god, dude. Chocobo is so huge. <laughs> That's the sound. Alright, boys. Is that a Que or a Warp? I mean, it's closer to Que. But I don't think it's either. <laughs> I think it's a bear. What is that? Diamond. Save, save crystal, maybe? Um, maybe it's... Whoa, look at him go! He's dead. Relic shop? That was my second guess. I already read this earlier. Can 
I see... Okay, allows person to sprint. Protects against dark. Protects against poison. Protects against dark and petrify. Why would I want the goggles then? Protect party members who are low on HP. It's so weird that relics are on their own, like, page. He has the most defense, so I'll give him that. Alright, how do I sprint? Okay, it's just automatic. Also, I just realized I'm Edgar. Aha, uh -huh. now I'm Darren. This is a lot nicer. After playing 5, at least. I would have gotten used to the slow movement speed, but after playing 5, it felt really slow. The Empire attacked Figaro Castle? Now we'll all be drawn into the battle. That dude's just trying to sleep, and I just ruined his whole day. What is this song? Oh my god, look at that music player! It's huge! <laughs> Are kids even allowed in here? So my guess is that this theme is actually this guy's theme. Because he's looking much different than everyone else in here. Duncan made his son, Vargas, practice a strict martial arts lifestyle. Vargas resented it. Okay. That's all, <laughs> That's all he had to say. Oh, no, it might be this guy. At the very least, you could give me a response. Stand back! He seems vaguely familiar. Wait a minute. He owes allegiance to no one. It will do anything for money. He comes and goes like the wind. Shadow. Epic. I kind of wish I had changed everyone's names to not all capitals. Because it's kind of annoying how, like, everyone's name is normal, but then my character's names look like they're yelling them all the time. But I didn't realize that was the case until after I had already named Terra, so... Rip. That Shadow! He slit his mama's throat for a nickel! Wow. Okay. <laughs> Better steer clear of him, I guess. I guess so, jeez. Uh, I think it's just one dog. Leave us. The dog eats strangers. Okay. All right, I get it. I, you, don't have to tell me twice. Out of the way, I gotta get this cider over to the old man. That's my job. Now scram. Man, everyone, everyone being me. <laughs> Everyone's got their jobs. Can't. Sorry. Sorry for trying to talk. Can I get a can I get a drink after all this NPC abuse I'm going through? The Empire's been invading one town after the next. We're not safe here. The guy at the counter, he's kinda creepy. Duncan students have no peers. Oh, okay, I see. Cafe and inn are connected. That theme was epic. I had never heard that theme before. <laughs> Electric slide. Has war really begun? I'd better return home. This isn't your home? Why are you here then? Why are you in someone's house randomly? Actually, is this even a house? It's huge. I guess it's like a hotel or something. Attack from the east, that way! 
Hey, what do you think you're doing? Barging in here while I'm trying to write a letter. <laughs> oh, uh, sorry. Even a millionaire can be startled. Okay, so it's your mansion. Then why is that girl in your ma- Oh. I think I figured out what kind of mansion this is. What do you mean there's always a draft? Do you have windows? Is there a secret in this room? Oh! Found it. How did you not see that? Secret library! Or secret dungeon? I'm learning more about this du this <laughs> learning more about this mansion. Secret bucket. What is going on down here? Dude, this has Final Fantasy 2 demonic dungeon written all over it. Empty? Why is there an empty chest? It's an old clock. It's not ticking. Is this like a puzzle? For later, maybe? Huh. Oh, wait. There's the clock over here, too. It's ticking. on the giant music making machine. Must be a clue. Yo, Limit! Thank you so much for the five gifted subs, my man. Oh, there's a chest here. Thank you so much, Limit. Good to see you, dude. Thank you for the 100 bits, mate. Well, I don't know what is going on with these clocks. Seems like there's some kind of secret attached to them, but maybe... Maybe they're just clocks. Maybe they're just clocks and that room just has money in it. Oh, Megiddo, they give it the two months, by the way. With the Prime. Thank you, man. It's good to see you. Has war really begun? Yeah, we'll probably do a double day today, to be honest, because I don't want to quit playing. And... We can't do a double day in two weeks because we're doing a special event for our four-year anniversary of uh, being a, a partner slash affiliate on Twitch. Aha! We got another clock elixir. That week's going to be really fun. We're going to be playing a bunch of games that I used to stream a long time ago. What is going on here? Why are we... What is... I just find some secret tunnel. Um, so yeah, we can't do a double day that week. We might be able to do a double day next week. But 
today is the first day of six. I feel like we we got it. The hype is real. He just did a moonwalk on me. I'm off work. Get lost. I don't like strangers. Bring me some cider and maybe I'll talk to you. Well, that one guy was bringing you cider, but he never made it. What happened to him? 